Hello everyone, welcome to you all. Now today in this video, we will try to explain how the physical address is calculated in case of 8086 microprocessor. Now in the previous video, where we have explained about the architecture of 8086 microprocessor, we know that bus interface unit holds a particular circuit arrangement which is responsible for calculation of physical address. It is written here also. Circuit for physical address calculation is available in BIU. So what is the function of this one and how it is done internally? We will try to explain here in this video. So as already I have mentioned, to do this one, whatever physical circuit we required is basically available within BIU. And to do that, we need the help of two registers. So remember, if we want to calculate physical address, I need two different different datas, one from segment register, another one from offset register. We have four different segment registers. Their name is code segment register, data segment register, stack segment register, extra segment register. And we need offset from these registers, that is IP, instruction pointer, base pointer, base register, stack pointer, source index, destination index. So to calculate the physical address, we need the combination of this one and this one. Means one from segment address, one from offset address. So as we know, all the address, all the registers of 806 is basically a 16-bit register. So they are content, that is segment address should be of 16-bit. So similarly, the offset address should be also 16-bit. So physical address means here, we want to understand how by using these two 16-bit addresses, a single 20-bit address can be calculated internally. And that 20-bit physical address, 20-bit address is called physical address. So you know we should remember here that the maximum memory size that 806 can access is 1 MB. We have explained this one in the previous classes or in the previous videos. So to give a unique number that each address to each of these memory registers within this memory space, we need 20 bits of address. So the addresses will be actually 20 bits, but here all the registers we have is 16 bit. So that is why this particular topic becomes too much important or viable in case of 806 because this is the method by which we convert a 20 bit address by using two 16 bit addresses. So the topic will be cleared by explaining a very simple example. So assume that a segment address is this one, offset address is this one. So you can find all of them are 16 bit addresses. By combining these two, our target is to find a 20-bit physical address. That's all. So to do that, we have to follow two different steps. Step number one, the content of segment register, that is segment address, has to be shifted towards left by four bits. So shift segment address towards left by 4 bit this is step number one so let's do that one so the segment address here is so the segment address here is 1005 hex so convert this hexadecimal value into binary value so its equivalent binary value will be like this one 0 0 0 1 0 means 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 5 0 1 0 1 so that is the equivalent binary number of this segment address now step 1 says we need to shift this content towards left by 4 bit so let's do that one so if i shift this to one left by a single bit then the value will be like this one 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 1 0 1 another 0 should come here 
similarly if i repeat this step four times what i will get another four zeros should come here so that means this 16 bit value is now converted into a 20 bit value whose equivalent hexadecimal value is this one one zero zero five zero hex so after doing this one what i need to do that is step number two step two add the offset address offset address with the outcome of step 1 so whatever result we are getting out of step 1 with that we need to add the content of absolute address so let's do that one so the outcome of the step 1 is this one 100050 0, 0, 0, 0, hex with that i will add the offset that is 5555 5, 5, 5, hex so let's do the addition hexadecimal addition 5 plus 0 it will be 5 5 plus 5 is equal to 10 that means a this is 5 this is 5 this is 1 so this is the 20 bit address and this one is called physical address So to calculate physical address what do you need to do first we get the value of the segment registers the value of segment register is called segment address shift this segment address by four bits towards left so that the segment address is now converted into a 20 bit value then we need to add directly the offset address that is the content of these registers with the outcome of the step one so by doing the simple mathematical addition we get the physical address which is you can find here is basically 20 bit right so this is the method by which we can do this calculation so now take an example already we know suppose we are considering code segment memory a particular segment of the memory may be code segment memory assume so we know the base address of this code segment or the starting location of this code segment should be denoted by segment register here the segment register is code segment register so code segment register contains a 16 bit value which basically defines the starting location of this segment which is used by the user to store the programs that it wants to execute by this processor so the starting location here is denoted by csr now now we know that the maximum size of each segment can be of 64 64 kb the maximum size of segment can be of 64 kb so that means the offset address offset within each segment can vary from this range 000, 000 hex that is the beginning location and the end location is f f f f hex you should remember here that this is the minimum value that we can represent by a 16 bit register this is the maximum value that we can represent by a 16 bit register so that is why one second we can say in this way the size of each segment maximum goes up to 64 kb now suppose within this segment i want to access this memory location or this memory register so that means how to do that so first we need to go to the beginning of this segment denoted by cs register then i need to travel a distance from the beginning up to this location to reach this particular register which i want to access so this distance that i need to travel to reach this particular register within this segment becomes my offset in this case 
it becomes offset so that offset will be denoted by instruction pointer because we know in case of code segment the segment address will be given by cs register and offset should be given by ip so if in this case in this example if this is the segment address that means we are talking about a particular segment which starts from this location so as per this example that can be denoted by cs register that is code segment register so that means we are talking about a code segment memory which starts from 10005 hex location and within this segment suppose i want to access this particular memory register whose distance from this one is 5555 hex so that becomes offset so here that offset will be given by ip so now the content of the cs register should be shifted towards left by 4 bits then the content of ip should be added with it then we will get a 20 bit value so that 20 bit value becomes the physical address of this location so remember in 8086 whenever we are accessing a memory each memory location or each memory register actually has two different different addresses one should be its offset another one should be its physical address so hopefully it is easy to understand thank you